1706 Mont Pelier. Today is January 7th. It's a video inspection after the, we unclogged the sewer line. We went through the back stack on the back of the basement. Got out to the trap. So they put plastic pipe in here. They changed it at one point. That's like under the porch. Okay, so really, really good point. So that's not what happened, and they repaired it, and they put that trap out where you get to it. Nice. It seems like the plumbing infrastructure in the house is a mixture of terracotta and plastic, yeah. and like good, uh, more modern insulation in good condition, and then slowly rotting older infrastructure. Or That's an easy thing. Soon, the pipe. Oh, yep, I see. Here we look for brakes and clogs. And yeah. You can see how there's a little more waste, like laying in here. See how this is like around here? Yeah. This is where it was clogged up at. Right here. Oh, so is that just shreds of like toilet paper that are basically yep. become plaster? Yeah. The pipes themselves look okay. Yeah, they look pretty good. Okay. Nothing's broken, nothing's collapsed, nothing out of ordinary. Mm -hmm. It's just basically a clog that happens. Yeah. Okay, so this could have been a lot worse. Could have been a lot worse. So now that we know it's not a lot worse, what would have been a worst case scenario? Like having to dig up and repair the we whole We dig pipe. up the whole floors and all that. Like all the way through, you know, pull out the old place, but it all looks pretty good. Then you gotta wash with the old lines. I'm sorry, can you think that one thing you gotta wash with the old older sewer lines here. What type of toilet paper are you using? You definitely don't use those flushable wipes. They're not flushable. Oh right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Just the it'll save anything septic. Anything septic safe would be good in these. Not necessarily.